Welcome everybody to this part. In the previous video we added the player, the background, the box and the coin. But when we run the game we don't see anything. So I'm just gonna go to the player and add some physics to it. So basically I'm just gonna add a new component called 2D rigid body or let me say rigid body 2D. So this is, is the rigid body. What do we mean by rigid body? When you have a rigid body you apply the gravity to this object so it's gonna be uh, like a normal body have a weight have a gravity all that kind of stuff so if I go to the player and choose the the tool here this uh, selection tool and I'm just gonna make it to the top a little bit and play the game it's gonna fall down why because we have a gravity so if you zoom out and run the game again it's gonna fall down all the way down <laughs> so why is that happening because we apply the rigid body to this object and it's gonna be affected by physics power by gravity so we have a gravity scale of one here and also we have a linear dra drag we have an angular drag and also we got a mass for this object and because it's got the mass we every object has a, a mass we got a gravity applied to it so that's why it's gonna fall down as you can see in the in the play mode so what about if we want this player to hit this red uh, box we need to add another thing we need to make this red box collider and also the player should be also a collider so in order to achieve that we need to go back ground and add something called 2d box collider and if you run that game you can see nothing happening because the box is a collider but the player is not a collider so we need to apply collider to it so basically I'm just gonna go to the player and add component to it and add here a box collider 2d box collider to the player alright so after we added the box collider to the player it should be collided with um, the box because the player is in the main layer and sh we should put also the coin and the back and uh, the coin and the player all these three objects should be in the same layer so I want to put them all at the main layer here if you run that game oh what happened just go to the player and give it a box collider and also went to the box and also I give it I didn't give it a box collider wow I added the box collider to the background <laughs> so I was missing I need to remove this from here and add it to the box collider and add it to the box so box collider 2d so right now I just got box collider to the box and also got box collider to the player they should be collided right now so run wow we got the collider and that is perfect so this is the first thing how we add a collider also we need to add a collider to the coin because we want to collide with the with the with a coin so we need to add a, also a box collider to it so right now we got the collider and the a collider on the the red box a collider on the coin so if I move the player a little bit to the right choosing this tool move it to the right and run it you can see we got a collider and that is perfect that is what we want first in order to make our game we need to apply this kind of physics to it all right in the next video we want to make some more um, movement to the player we we need to make this player move jump uh, and so forth 
So we're going to see you in the next video, guys. Thank you.